Oh boy. You're perfect. Help train my little brother. Perfect for what? What's the matter with you? Oh, uh, let's see. Cr crush Ken. What? What does that even mean? What does that even mean? I don't... Okay, well, I'm gonna take out my favorite fighting type guy first. Well, that dig won't work. Let's use an ember on him. It, in case the peck doesn't take care of him. Oh, well, I get, apparently, according to this, the Goodbye Bird is like some kind of animal rights movie. Came out in. Wow. Came out in 1993. <laughs> That's. How old was the movie I watched when I. I watch it. What the hell? Huh. Oh, well, none of you would probably even know what the hell the Goodbye Bird is. I think it was on the cover of Angels in the Outfield. I mean, during the uh, playthrough of Angels in the Outfield. Not the playthrough. But this is a playthrough. What I'm talking about is the commercials. The commercials for that movie. Yeah, I'm not seeing anything uh, over here about the Oh well. Moral of the story, old movies are old movies. Yes, 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 I'll take it, I'll take it. Mm. Burr, burr, burr. Burr, burr, leer, fuck leer. I got mirror move. One of the best uh, Firo moves ever. Probably the best, in fact. I can mimic your move. I can make that your move. Suck it, suck it. Meh, 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 meh. All right, let's put this to the test. And let's start off with some ember action. Yeah! Fire punch right back at you, son. Son, burn, baby, burn. Hit my gems dead. Burn, baby, burn. That's kind of sad. Burn, much uh, hit my gem, burn. You have to harness your feelings. <laughs> For those of you who've seen, for the two of you who've seen Three Ninjas 3, you must learn to see with your ears. Oh man, that was such a bad one. Oh, I loved it so much when I was a kid though because it had ninjas and little kids who were going to be ninjas. Uh, let's try some Pursuit. Like, just to stalk him. Stalk the little fairy. Stop the Clefairy! We must stop it! Clefairy is my favorite Pokemon I played all the time! I personally like Silver version the best! I have a horrible impersonation of Mr. Schwarzenegger, but I try anyway, what can I say? I am a showman. Shaman. Fun fact, I am a shaman. No. <laughs> oh man, what? Are there any shamans left in the world? I know there's monks, but I mean. I mean, when I was a kid, I remember my dad having me visit, like, a, like an old Islamic monk who was super interesting. I, I think he was a monk. I, I'm not quite sure what they called him. Oh, well, it was super weird. He, I, I guess my dad, for a short time, thought I was possessed by, by an evil force or whatever. Because when I was a kid, like, and he had me go and visit that monk, what, whatever he put on me, like, made that area just, like, swell up super, like, red, and I had to go visit the doctor to get an allergy shot. Oh, god, my butt's so, so attracted to Clefairy. <laughs> oh, dear. Oh, uh, there, there's a whole slot of jokes for you right there. Ooh, this'll be a curious thing. Clefairy, does, didn't Clefairy worship the moon in the anime? Ooh, let's see. Will mirror moves copy the uh, moonlight or the. Ah, uh... oh, God! God damn me apart, buttocks! Eh, oh well, what can you do? Let's give it another fury. Yes, I know, I know, she's really hot, but gosh dang it, man, your friends are depending on you. Oh, this wound cuts so deep. Oh, gosh. Oh, dear. All right, all right, come on. Come on, pull yourself together. I know, I know. You must, you must... <laughs> Why? 
Why are you doing this to me, butt? Come on. Come on. Just sick your beak into her. Sick it in. Just plunge it right in. Yeah, you know. Oh, that's not. That's not. You're not any good to me, but You're useless. You hear me? You're useless. Now mirror move that shit. Mirror move that hoe. To your hoe. She's. She's trying to kill you! Can't you see it? She's tearing us apart. Oh, excuse me. Yeah, she's tearing you apart. She's tearing us apart. She doesn't want us to be together. <laughs> and she was the end of you. <laughs> ah. Do you have any, uh, no? I'm trying to look Go through the west shore, my eyes obscured my vision And I to five miles on my way I began to learn to listen And I'm not so grown it's all comforted Hello there, I don't know what happened <laughs> My recording had apparently died In the midst of my recording this he But I'm back, you didn't miss nothing I just summoned good old Ronnie boy, and now he's about to kick the knees. Or he's just going to get hyped up on that old love juice, you know. You know what I'm talking about. And yeah, it's going to hit two times, because it's a double kick. It's a double kick. What can you do? I wish it was more like that one meme. What's it called? I can't, I can't put my name on it, but it's like the Dr. Evil meme, where it's just like... Double kick. With, with the whole little uh, quotation marks thing. <laughs> oh gosh, I love awesome powers. Sludge, that ain't do nothing on good old Ronnie. He's part of you, he's part of poison. Part of him is in you, and now you're dead. Moral of the story, folks, don't fall in love. It kills people, as, you, as demonstrated by Pokemon. As demonstrated by Brock and who else is there? Woo! What's this? Rain dance. I'm not gonna use it. I ain't gonna use it. I ain't gonna use it. I ain't gonna use it. It's a piece of shit. <laughs> oh, where she? How kind of? Where can we go? Hey, better, 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 better. Swing. Hello, pink lady. Yes, I would like you to heal my butt. Heal it super hard, girl. Mm. <laughs> that's 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 super weird. I doubt Nurse Joy will ever talk to me again. I don't even think she has a name in this one, does she? As far as I'm aware, it's just like she's just that one pink-haired lady who stands in the Pokemon Center and heals your Pokemon. I mean, yeah, she's a nurse, but. Is she the same one from the anime? I mean, I figure she was, but there isn't an Officer Jenny here, as far as I can tell. So, <laughs> is that not part of the canon in this universe? I, I don't quite understand this. But oh well. What can you do? What can you do? What can you do with the heal your Pokemon? Nurses, nurses. Woo! A venom! Internet that I already have. Well, that's anticlimactic. I think I may have captured one of those in between recordings. If so, I do apply. I do apologize. I do apologize for not showing it. Is there anybody I need to switch out really quick? I don't think there is. Why? Yes. Yes, there is. There's quite a few I need to switch out. Ronnie, there you go. Hi, Kiwi. Oh, never mind. I already beat your ass. What about you, dog? Nope. Beat him. What about you? You? Yeah! Winged Mirages. You mean so oh ho oh co oh Oh! I'm an idiot. There isn't Capricorn Aricorns here. Hello, I was busy. My mind was deep into Soul Silver, okay? I have been replaying Soul Silver 
And so far, it's it's pretty decent. Granted, I wish I didn't have to face down the Kimono Sisters, but it's still better than what we feel that Ruby was, because let's face it, no other game is gonna have you visit another world ever again, and that's super lame. Tomato, tomato. Maybe someday, maybe when they come out with Pokemon Stadium 3, you know, that thing they should have came out with a long time ago when Ruby and Sapphire came out, and instead we've got the horror, the absolute horror that was, in fact, friggin' eh, what's it called? Friggin' Pokemon Coliseum. Why? Why did I lose? How could this happen to me? Made my mistakes. Tried so hard, but now I'm fading away. Mm, yes, I believe I have taught it fly, but I'm not quite sure. Oh well, maybe maybe I'll be able to beat this guy. This year's this year's Speedwell. Maybe that will teach you a lesson to question my trainerific abilities. Trainerific, that's a word now. Deal with it. Son, sonny boy, my good man. Why is he poi- oh, he must- it must be a physical thing. Okay. I was gonna say my double kick poisoned- what? <laughs> and then we guess another bird type, and you know what that means, kids. I say, I'm going to kill every last one of your bird Pokemon. Do the Thunderbolt. Shut it down. One of those heads is gonna have to go. Ho to Orson Welles. Where I say I earned so many points, and no, I will not change Pokemon because I'm not adult Marlin. That's Marlin. Hey, I do, I'm fighting the guy from uh, Finding Nemo, the main character from Finding Nemo. How I, I find that really weird when, when, uh, Movies are named after not the main character. I mean, movies and or books. Like, it's just like, like, Les Mis being, like, the, the cover of Les Mis is Cosette. Even though the main character, even though if the child would be anything, it should be, if it had to be any child, it should have been the, is in the army rebellion type people. <laughs> Or if, if they had to have the main character, why not just make it be, what's his name? Hugh Jackman, Jean Valjean, yeah, hello. I forgot who Jean Valjean was, I should be ashamed of myself. No! Oh, shit. Shit nuggets, nope, 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 nope. Go Raisei, do your thing, we don't need any instant dug deaths. Doug deaths, Doug deaths. What you gonna do? What you gonna do when I paralyze you? Right say, right say. Use that thunderbolt. Use that thunderbolt on the Pidgeotto. Man, those translations are pretty bad. When like, like during the Pokemon movie when they mistook like three Pokemon for a different type of Pokemon, like say uh, Pidgeotto. No, no, no. Like Pidgeot for Pidgeotto and Alkazam for Scyther. It was so weird. I think I brought, I think I even brought up the whole Scyther one before, but the whole Pidgeotto one, I mean, I guess that you can, uh, that you can give it a pass since they're like one of all form away from each other, but hardcore Pokemon kids will recognize that shit. And like when the first movie came out, that's when all kids were hardcore Pokemon kids. I mean, even the, even the not-so-nerdy job-type little kids that were into Pokemon, yo. Even my friend who had given up his- who had given up all of his toys when he was like- when he was like seven, was into Pokemon. He still had cards, even though he didn't have toys. Boy, did I feel bad for that kid. I still have all my toys, and I'm an adult! 
Maybe, maybe that's my, maybe that's a personal problem, but, but I have no regrets. I'm glad I hold on, held on to all my action figures and such. Of course, I can't find my favorites because I took them everywhere I went. Yeah, Bo can handle this. He was literally dragged out by Pidgeotto. And one quick attack should wipe that Pidgey clean off of this the face of this earth. Go, Bo. Destroy them. Yeah, you know the drill. Right say, right say. My little orange Pikachu. I know, I know. I'm being a troll. I apologize. I apologize. That's, that's awfully rude of me as a Pokemon fanatic. How do you guys feel about Mega Evolutions, per se? Me? I think they're weird. Like, I mean... It... How do I put this into words? Like, I'm not opposed to the idea. I just feel like they could have done a bit more with that. Like, actually make them evolutions instead of like putting them like just throwing on like a wig and a hat for them i mean some have more than just than just your your long hair but a lot of them do and i'm not really happy with a lot of the way a lot of the ways they turn out if i see some more and they're like better if they're more entertaining and more pleasable they can be accepted as more of an evolution than an upgrade then I'd be willing to buy it. Then I'd be saying, okay, this is a great idea. I am enjoying this. And you've got trade evolutions already, so I can accept that. But the trade evolutions, at least those are more distinct. These ones, uh, the ones they've released so far, like the only one I can really remember in particular is Mew 3, and at least that one's half acceptable. The other ones, like, Amphromos looks like it just got some of uh, Mareep's fluff stapled onto it. Like, what else is there? Uh, Absol, I remember Absol has one. Does Jinx have one? I don't think they do. I think the world's trying to forget about the day people invented Jinx. Oh boy, I sure am. <laughs> and yet, I love Gen 1 so much, but we, we all remember the failure of Jinx. May she rest in peace. Go duo! I... I think Ronnie can survive one more fight. Let's put that challenge to the test. One for one face. Okay, two for two. One face. Wow, Do duo is biased as fuck. No, live! Survive! 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 Please? Survive! Yeah, for once, me saying that. Actually lets him survive. I say that phrase a lot whenever I'm playing uh whenever I'm playing Shining Force and it never fuck, fuck I don't give a shit. I know how to head I don't need a tutorial for my Pokemons, okay? I've been playing this shit since I since my sixth sixth birthday. Yeah, since my sixty-sixth birthday. I heard a derp a derp a derp. But I, I don't really... I mean, I guess that's why they got rid of it at some point. I mean, this was the only game to have tutorials, as far as I was aware. Granted, for the lols, when I first got this game, I decided to look through the tutorial. It didn't really teach me anything new. I believe it t teaches you the Versus seeker, seeker. That was the only thing that I felt was useful for me. Because you know me, I, once I beat the story, I'd be like, well, that was a good game, toss it aside. I mean, unless you're counting silver, in which case, the game wasn't over until, let's face it, until you're sick of the damn thing, which you're not. You're never sick of gold and silver, and that's what's so great about it. That's what's so great about them. Save for that one itsy-bitsy tiny flaw with a kimono system. Other than that, love it, love it. Couldn't get any more pro- Miss E, wow! Wow, thank you. Thank you, Mystical Force, that allowed that Spearow to miss and let my Ronnie survive for one more hit. Wow, I need to switch out Ronnie eventually, after this battle, perhaps. And then, then, uh, should we tackle him? I say wrap up this side, and then if this side isn't wrapped up by then, 
then we should uh, fucking take down that. Uh, then we should freaking tackle that other side. If we don't beat him. Yep, that's one other Pidgey down. Just line them up and all in my right save will knock it right down, Perry. Tyler Perry. I'm fighting Tyler Perry. Finally! We've had enough of Medea. She was your only good idea. We've had enough. The public has had enough. Retire. I will kill every last one of your Pidgeys until you retire. Ah, thank goodness he doesn't have P uh, Pidgeys. Otherwise, he'd be into giving me a lawsuit. I've heard Tyler Perry is lawsuit happy. I'm not sure if that's true or not. Oh well. I'm sick of talking about Tyler Perry. Let's talk about the good things in life. Ah, uh, ah, uh, because it's implying that uh, he's not a good positive impact. I mean, he was at a time, but his time. He, he, he's lived past his prime. Let's just put it that way, folks. Oh dear. And Spiro is out. Yeah, he is. Goodbye. Bye. Goodbye. Bye. Goodbye. Goodbye. Goodbye, Tyler Perry. Hope you don't make movies. Bye. These bikers think you're so tough. I got biking my own. Yeah, I'm hardcore. Let's switch out my uh, new arena here.